Okay, you guys, it's the moment of truth for my wine. <laughs> You're gonna die laughing. Look at that. <laughs> this is my wine, you guys. <laughs> Actually, this is an important part of the process. So you're supposed to actually, every day, like several times a day, when the, when the grape comes up like this, you're supposed to push it down, right? And you do this for several days until it ferments. Now, I think that these bubbles mean it's fermented. And whether or not it, they're fermented, I don't care. I'm over the experience. I'm going to drain them today, my darlings, okay? So we're bottling this puppy like a dog today, okay? Are you scared yet? Are you scared? Okay, so let's take this and slowly pour it without like making a big fat mess into this thing here. <laughs> okay, I think I, I have to do it a little bit at a time, you guys. I can't just pour the whole pot in at the same time. That's crazy. It's very messy. It's like a very messy process. <laughs> I mean, even I'm scared. Okay, so I've, I've like, you know, squeezed all the juice that I can from this. So now let's, um, I don't know what to do. Like I have to figure out, I need to get this into this pot here. And, and then strain it with like one of these. Just going with this little cup here and slowly just pour this through here. Make sure that we don't have any little, you know, whatever. Okay, so I've done that, got these out. This is now empty. So I'm ready to put this in a bottle and put it away for a couple of days or weeks or months or years or whatever I'm not going to sit here and tell you that the color looks like wine I mean it doesn't <laughs> I don't know what the hell this is it's like a weird sort of almost rosé which I was going more for like a, but it's like a cloudy rosé it's not a clear rosé so you know this isn't wine you guys I'm not saying this is wine it's just a beverage okay it's a beverage okay you guys so there. My dad made wine when I was a little girl. It wasn't with grapes, you know, but and but he put yeast and things in there, I remember. But I couldn't find yeast, so there's no yeast. There's some sugar and some cinnamon, but there's no yeast. So, you know, it, it looks a little weird, but okay. I mean, what do you want me to do? What do you want me to tell you? I'm going to put this in a bottle, you guys. Let's just rinse this out a little bit, you know. Get some hot water. And um, then we will, yeah. Okay, let's try to pour this in without making a huge mess. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So yeah, try not to be distracted by the potatoes in the back, but it's kind of a rosé. I was going for more of a red, <laughs> but I have a rosé. Oh, isn't that interesting? But it's like a rosé, very clouded rosé, not very clear. So obviously, you know, it's not like a real, you can't really take this as anything. I, I don't know what it's going to even taste like. But let's try to find a lid for that. Hold on. I've got a nice little lid that says Paris. <laughs> Let's push that down. Can't get it any further down. I don't know if it's because, um, you know, I can't get it any further down. So it's going to have to be this. Okay. Now we have to figure out like a label and, you know, pretty up the bottle. Oh, you know what we could do? We could put the bottle in this. Hold on a second. Basket thing. We could put the bottle into it like so. <laughs> Yum, yum! Mm. I am so proud of myself. I mean, even if this turns out to taste like, what do you call it? Um, like um, cider or vinegar or whatever, I am still proud of myself. <laughs> I made rosé wine, you guys. Oh, I'm so proud of myself, you guys. Oh, my gosh. Oh. So, okay, so I had two empty bottles that I had in the in the flat. So I poured the, the leftovers into this former martini bottle. 
<laughs> and then Chablis bottle that the Chablis is obviously a white wine, but we're not going to, we're not keeping score, right? And this is the Pièce de Résistance, my darlings. Ah, girls and boys, <gasps> girls and boys, oh my gosh, do you think this is going to taste good or not? Tell me the truth. Do you think it's going to taste good? 